Hi everyone! We're exciting to present our new widget Super 3D for Motion Tools Pro. We expand the exciting new possibilities in After Effects. Starting from the 24.1 version, you can add 3D files into the project. OBG, GLB and GLTF files. The new release includes a brand new 3D engine, which improves the 3D quality like never before in After Effects. So we add new Super 3D widget with basic primitives, textures and few helpful tools. Now you can add 3D object in one click. In the free version, we have few basic stuff. The first step is to save your project. All models files will be collected in the root of the project folder. Next, select the model and material, then press create. Done. Any new model will be created as new object. What if you want to try a different material or model for the same layer? For this, we create replace function. Simply select the desired layer, choose a new model or texture and press replace. That's it. This function also works if you've animated the layer. You can update it with one click. If you only need to update the model or texture, you can deselect one of them. It's that easy. We are using the promising OpenGOTF file format. This means that you can update the textures on your own. Add your details combined with other images to create something new. For such simple tasks, there is no need to use any other 3D software. One more thing. Let's attempt to recolor the object. Currently, we can't add effects to the 3D layers. Adobe developers have provided us with a new effect-driven technique to solve this. We need to create a solid layer and use calculation effects to take the 3D layer as a mask. This process could take some time, so we've created a one-click solution. Select the 3D layers and press the Effects button. Done. The original layer will be hidden, and you can add various effects to this layer. You can recolor it or add any deformations. That's our basic functionality. Here is few more details. Our widgets are responsive, so you can make the size as you want. By these two buttons, you can change the icon size. These settings will be saved even after restarting the extension. We also have alternative list view to focus on naming. Lately, with more collections, you'll find them from these header buttons. Let's review the setup process. The free Super 3D widget comes pre-installed in Motion Tools Pro from version 1.4. Please note that it only works with After Effects starting from version 24.1. You will find it in the content settings. Super 3D widget in the scripts section. It is large, so I advise to create the new layout for it. Let's edit. Great. To keep the Motion Tools installer compact, we upload all materials to the server. So, for the start, you need to press Download Library button. This process won't take much time, but it weights approximately 2000 megabytes. If there are any issues with the download from the settings in the bottom right corner, you have few options. Automatically download core library again, or download and install it manually. From the widget settings or from the widget content settings, you can find the link to the Pro version. After purchase, you need to press Update button. If you don't see the notification, just try to wait a bit more time. You will see the notification about Super 3D. Press Install. This action will activate the widget. For double-check, we can reopen extension or just update it. The rest of material will be available. Another indication that everything great is a new widget header in the content settings. 
you can manually download all new material by clicking the download button in the top right corner. Or you can set it to download automatically in the settings. And that's all guys, hope it will be useful for your work. See you next time.